hard to believe this took 78 tons of pressure to push this thing in. I'm Steve Radebush, uh, Spec Machine, and my partner Bruce Grill. We work together and we, uh, we, we make parts for every industry. And now we're rebuilding the steam locomotive for Mid-Continent Railway Museum. You've been doing this for a year. Uh, so give me like a synopsis of, of, what's, of what's happened here in the last year. Um, in the last year, let's see, we've uh, completely stripped the locomotive down, steam cleaned it, sandblasted it, um, repaired all the cracks in the frame. Um, all the spring rigging is now rebuilt. The driving boxes are about completely rebuilt. And now we're tramming the engine to put the driving wheels under and getting ready to bore cylinders. The bolts are made out of 8620, no, I'm sorry, 4140, and um, they're tapered bolts and fitted bolts, so each hole is drilled and tapered, and then you fit the bolt till it stops, the head stops 3 sixteenths of an inch roughly before it makes contact, and then you drive the bolt in the rest of the way. And so the taper is fitted and the head is tight to it, and there's no movement at all. The wheels actually got shipped out to Strasburg, Pennsylvania to have new tires put on and at the same time they they repaired and replaced a couple pins. This happens to be a new pin which goes to the main cylinder which runs the other axles and at that point in time they also inspected and repaired any journals that needed repair because they have large enough equipment to actually put this whole thing in one lathe and turn it. And that's why it went out there. And they have a good reputation for doing good work.